dwellers and welcome to another episode of Captive Minecraft. My name is Caveman Films and today we are going to be trying to tackle some challenges. For those of you who don't know what Captive Minecraft is, every YouTuber on Earth is doing it apparently now after I, I started it, which I'm perfectly fine with. I mean, I'm just a trendsetter. That's all it is. No, I'm just kidding. I'm really kidding. But for those of you who don't know what Captive Minecraft is, basically there's a world border around us. And uh, I have to do achievements in order to expand the world border. But we're at a bit of a predicament because, at the current moment, there are not any achievements I can do and make progress with, which is kind of a bummer. Now, the achievement I'm going for at the present moment, I'm trying to uh, first make an infinite water source because I need to catch some fishies. And I can't catch fishies unless there's something in the water. And there has to be water for me to catch said fishies. So, what I've got here is I've got some dirt, and apparently you guys told me that I can't make an infinite water source until the dirt's gone, and then this happens. Ba-boom! Look at that. We have a little beautiful beach, two blocks deep, should be perfectly able for me to catch some fishies in here, and so, all we really need to do now is get some fishing rod. Now, here's the thing. I said some fishing rod, even though I mean to get a fishing rod, but here's the thing. I don't got enough strength. I don't got enough strength. So, we're gonna have to try to kill some spiders. And spiders kind of aren't spawning really easily. We have a little room downstairs where hopefully they are doing their job in spawning, but I'm not really certain, and I might be leading myself to my certain demise. So, I'm trying my hardest now to not die. Uh, my rival, the silverfish, are down here as well, and they are freaking annoying. Because, <laughs> I don't even know, they're just, they're just terrible. They're just terrible to deal with. You know, they don't, they don't flush. That's one thing I don't like about them. Okay, there's one right now. Hey, you little bugger. What you doing? Oh. Ah, dang it! How'd you do that? <laughs> You're not supposed to be able to break through my floor. They are completely and utterly destroying my my plans. Oh my god. I wish I brought my pickaxe so I could at least try to save myself from the scourge. That is the freaking silverfish. Oh my gosh. We're just looking around. There's a demon bird. There's lots and lots of slimes here. Very, very lovely to see you guys. But uh, I don't need you at the moment. I uh, currently do not need your services. So, what I would like to do... There's a demon bird. Demon bird! Demon bird! Yeah! Kill all the demon birds! This is my my monster spawning room that's not doing a very good job and I'm very, very afraid that those freaking silverfish are going to just drop down here and kill me. But on the bright side, look, we got a little shortcut. Kind of. Eh! No! Hup! Yes! We made it across. <laughs> I really, really just want to get rid of that silverfish spawner, but I can't. Um, so I'm trying to think of a way, because now that we have this area... Oh my goodness, I heard you, silverfish, and I saw I saw your freaking little beady eyes. Come here, come here and die. Come here and die like a man, or insect, more like, because that's what you are. But... Um, Okay, we gotta get over here before they can get to me. So I thought I was being really, really smart, but apparently they can still reach me from those two blocks there. That's a bummer. But, hey, you know what? We have uh, we got a little light hole, so there's still some light that's peeking in down there. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back upstairs. I'm going to get me a few, a few necessary blocks, I think. I'm going to need them because silverfish are just annoying. And they're going to keep on breaking through the floor until there's no floor left. Or until the floor is made out of something not made out of stone. So, we are going to go on a little grinding spree where we're going to cut down a lot of trees, get a lot of planks, and then we're going to completely and utterly renovate that delicious dungeon floor. So, I think we're going to be pretty A-OK. -okay. And it's still night... Oh, no, it's turned daytime. Cool. Okay. I also wasted a lot of my food. You know what? I'm also going to do one thing. Because this is our little beach, I'm going to put some sand I'm going to put some sand in place of the dirt. It's not like I'm going to use it for glass or anything. So, there we go. We got a nice little caveman beach. And you guys are doing fine. As you can see, we have Pigsley. 
And I don't actually think I gave you a name. I'm going to call you Pigifer. Uh, we got Betsy and Bonnie. Don't question their life choices. That's just normal. And then we got lots of chickens that I am probably going to devour at some point in my life. Um, <laughs> okay, so now that we have got that beach taken care of, mind your words. Mind your words, caveman. Don't cause any sort of negativity. Yes, there we go. We'll take that steak. I'll take the diamond pickaxe just in case because we'll probably mine out everything. Um, maybe a fence. You know, I just got a pretty good idea. We're going to conquer. We're going to freaking conquer. Completely and utterly conquer the silverfish. Now, I need some more saplings. Here they are. I'll take the steak too just in case because I know I'll get hungry. Got bone meal or club dust as I like to call it. And, but, no! There we go. Also, I, could, I should probably attend to my garden a little bit because it's looking a little, uh, weird. Ah, uh, hold on. I've, I've got some, I've got some landscaper in me that's trying to poke its head out. And I'm like, fine, I will, I will abide by your terms, Mr. Landscaper Caveman. What are you doing? Well, I want you, Mr. Not Landscaper Caveman, to place all these blocks down on the ground. It pleases me so much. Look at that, I made it grass for you. You should be so happy of me. That'll be a hundred thousand dollars. What? I'll take a check. It's okay. Hey, I gave you valuable advice. If you don't want to take it, that's fine. But you need to give me my money. I think I just con- I got- I got conned by myself. <laughs> I just got freaking conned by my alter ego. That says a lot about me as a person. Okay, I'm gonna also, uh, put a fence down here. I'm gonna take this one so we have a congruent little area that we can reach in through. And um, I'm going to actually cut this out so I can walk through the pen when I want to. As long as no stupid animals get in my way. Molto bene! That's Italian for very good! So, you just learned something. How about that? Cavemen shouldn't know how to speak other languages. I know that's exactly what you're thinking, but you know what? I am a very cultured, uncultured fool, okay? Big, out of the way. There we go. Look at that. It's a beautiful, beautiful pit of death. I say pit of death because you're going to die when I get hungry. Come on. There we go. If you're wondering what I'm doing, the correct answer is I have no idea. It just looks better this way. I know I'm missing one corner, but I don't know. It looks pretty good this way because we have our butcher friend right here. Look at him. If we bring him some raw pork chop, he'll give us money. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice, guys? You guys don't look very happy about it. I don't blame you. I understand your situation. I think you guys too, too. Look, we got a new baby. I'm going to name you Clucky. Okay, so Clucky, you stay there. And I'm going to actually put my tree down where I wanted it to be, which is right there. Lovely, lovely tree. And I'm going to put this bone meal here. If you tell anyone I'm using bone meal, I'm going to be very sad. Okay. I feel like the staircase is interfering with said tree. Ah... Uh, so we ran out of club dust because of that. You know, it's fine. It's perfectly, perfectly natural. If you don't want to grow, don't drink milk. And you won't grow. But I want you to drink milk tree. I want you to drink all the milk in the world. I've got cows. That's, that's kind of like their job right now, is provide me milk. Also, I think milk should provide at least a little bit of hunger. I mean... It's just like water. If you drink water, you get full. It's not just like, oh, well, I've got a liquid stomach and a food stomach. And those two even interact with each other. Look across. Um, <laughs> they don't work. Okay, so apparently we're going to have to just wait on the tree growing because we don't have anything that we can use to... Let's see, I'm just checking. We have some nether quartz. I don't see any clubs. don't see any clubs. Oh, we do have clubs. Never mind. Never mind, caveman, you liar. Okay, we've got 24 pieces of club dust or bone meal. And we are going to... Yes! Look at that! It's kind of small, but, you know, don't judge. Don't judge. It's, it's just a very, very hardy tree. We've got some wood now. We're going to get some more wood. We're going to use that to make a floor. We're going to make a floor and stop the silverfish from taking over. We're going to make the floor, cut this tree, call it Dover. 
You like this song? I'm making it up as I go along. You can probably tell. But if you don't like it, then well, oh well, L. I don't really care what you have to think, neither should you, unless you stink, because stinking's kind of nasty, and you should take a bath, and then you'd fix that problem, and you wouldn't be bad at math. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. Now, you know what? What if we move the sapling a few blocks this way? Boom, 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 boom. Yes. There we go. I'm just going to leave it there, though. I like that tree. Because I think we honestly have enough that we should be able to cover the floor with all the stuff I'd like it to be covered in. Got some mistakes so we don't starve. Got some torches for lighting. And we have our beautiful, very, very close to breaking iron sword. And also a stone sword. And also a slime. Hello, slime. What's up? You just want to be my friend? Oh, you died, and you made more friends for me. Yay! Now you're all dead, too. That kind of sucks. It's okay, though, because you're completely and utterly replaceable. Oh, I don't think you're happy about me killing your your family. I don't think that's a good thing. Might not necessarily be a bad thing, though. Come here! Come here! Let me just murder all of you! I can make some delicious slime drop soup. Perfect. Okay. Well, I hear a zombie. Do I see said zombie? No, I just see... <laughs> you died. Also, Demon Bird. Demon Bird, come here. Yeah, I feel so much better. Okay, I can definitely hear the creatures of the night peeking their ugly creeper faces at me. Come here. Oh, you can't reach me. You can't get me. Hmm. I would say that's a problem, but it's, it's really not. Okay, caveman, think this through. If you do this, they can't reach you, but now you can reach them. Or can you not? You cannot, because he is deciding to phase through the wall. Silverfish! Come here. You know what? You know what? I don't even care anymore. Come here. Come here. Come here. Die. Die. Glorious death for you. Okay, so we got our sticks. And by that, I mean planks. And now we are going to... Like, just develop a beautiful, beautiful area for us to live in peace. And if they don't like it, they can lump it. That's what I have to say. That was a silverfish. That's fine. You guys think you can defeat me? You guys think you can defeat the caveman? He's using his brain for once. I know it's a very scary prospect, but I trust in myself. Okay. I don't want you to be able to reach me. You're trying to. You're trying your hardest. It's okay. I don't hold that against you. Why can't I hurt you? That uh, That's cheating. <laughs> okay, really. Why? The freaking silverfish! Come on. You know what? It's okay. You can cheat. You can cheat all you want. I don't care. I don't care right now. You're going to be done for very, very soon. Aha! Yes. This is working. Look at all this crap going on. And they can't reach me either. Let's see, if we get this over here, give us a nice little passage of uh, freedom going on. Yeah. Yeah. I know you're trying to get me. I know you're trying so hard. Look at that! You spawned and tried to murder me. Well, I don't appreciate that, Silverfish. Nope! Nope! No! No, not the smartness of you. Please, no, stop. Oh, no, no, no. Please, no. Please. No! No! Oh, oh, my plan has backfired. My plan has backfired a lot. Oh, no, 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 no. No! This is why cavemen don't use their intellect. It's because they lose their skins and die and stuff. I'm just glad that the creeper didn't explode. But now we have a new situation on our hand. Because stupid freaking silverfish led the stupid freaking creepers up to my stupid freaking platform. Now we have a stupid freaking problem that is really, really not cool. Can I get my stuff back, guys? Honestly, you're not doing anything with it. You got a skeleton here, too. This is just making matters worse. It's all because of the creepers. If I ha <sighs> okay, this is... um. 
I'm really trying my. Where's the. Um. 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 Guys. My boundary is invisible, and I'm very confused by this. What are you looking at? You made this problem happen. You know it. Okay. So we can maybe, Ninja, get everything. Go away from me. No! No! Dang it! There's a midget with a sword. It's my sword, and it has it. And I think we're on hard mode, so that's probably making things a lot more... Yeah. We're on hard mode, so don't think that Caveman is just losing to it because he sucks. Even though I know for a fact I do. At the game. Nothing else. I don't... Well, I mean, lollipops, I guess. Um, popsicles. Yeah. I, I, I've been known to suck a good popsicle once in a while. My favorite flavor is blue raspberry. But that has nothing to do with the situation at hand. And honestly, I am getting very, very angry at this whole shtick going on. Come on. Oh, hey, look, spiders. Hey, look, that's exactly what I want. Hey, look, come here and die. What are you killing me with? with ah! What? How are you hurting me? What is shooting me? What is... Ah! No, no. Bad. No, dang it! Okay, we got this. Just be calm, caveman. Just be calm. They can't hurt you. Yes, they can. But it's okay. It's okay because you are inventive. And you have an idea. It's probably not going to work. But at least you're trying. Wait a s- no. I can't use lava. Lava is no bueno. Unless I can get all my stuff first. We'll save the lava. <sighs> I feel like if I bring the bucket down there, I'm just going to lose it. That's honestly how I feel right now. Oh my god, caveman. Caveman, the incompetent caveman. <laughs> it's ironic. At least in my opinion. I keep on dying in caves. Hey, a spider! Hey, gimme! I want... I'm not going to die. Yet. I'm at least getting a fishing rod in this episode. That is my big plan. That's my big plan. And you gave me two. I need one more. Come on. Come on. How are we going to get... It's all your fault, Silverfish! Demon birds are in on it, obviously, but... I just wasted my fire charge. Great. If I go over here... Okay. And make light sources... And burn things to death. Come here. Come here and burn. Burn for your sins. Come here. Yes. Yes. Everything go into this fire. Perfect. You're doing a great job. No. That's not even fair. Now there's lava. But I don't see any monsters besides the silver. Oh, hello. Where did my crap go, by the way? Where did my crap go? I don't see it anymore. I don't see my crap. Did it go away? I have lost my items despawned. That's exactly what happened. My items freaking despawned. Because of idiotic creatures. Also, I lost my spider web. The whole reason why I was doing this in the first place. These silverfish are really, really, really smart. Now, I'm not one for changing the difficulty level. But I think I need a respite right now. By killing all of you! Okay. We're good. Caveman. Everything's good. You're not dead. You're very, very close to losing all your sanity. You've lost your diamond pickaxe. You've, you've lost a lot of things that are entirely because of the silverfish. And you've even lost your skin. The one thing that identifies yourself as yourself. It's great. Perfectly fine. I mean, look at this freaking mess! Why? Silverfish! Why are you so annoying? You and your friends! It's like the creepers and silverfish together make an unstoppable death trap. Unstoppable, annoying, infuriating death trap. And, I have noticed something, they're spawning outside of the world border. Demon bird, shut it! Oh my god, okay. It's fine. You, you, um, we just have to roll with the punches. 
I'm going insane. I know why it's called Captive Minecraft now, because you want to be captive. <sighs> You're going to end up in a freaking mental facility because of silverfish and creepers and death and explosions and items despawning and you going there repeatedly over and over and over again dying and dying and dying and dying and dying I lost all the saplings too good thing we had that tree there oh my god okay it's great it's perfectly fine caveman you're an idiot it's it's unforeseeable or it's actually very foreseeable that this kind of crap would happen to you. We're going to use this netherrack because that place is a hellhole! And we're going to patch up the mess that those freaking silverfish and creepers have made. And I am going to then put the game back in its designated game mode. And see if my life can get any better from this period in time. Because honestly, I kind of doubt it. This is terrible. This is not fun. This is not a game anymore. It's war. And they're winning. I don't like to admit it, but I'm losing. Why can't I even put the... Look! Like, I can't even place items down right where they're supposed to be because I don't even understand what's going on! Like, why? Is it so hard? Demon bird, if you impede my progress, you're dead. Like, I can't even place... I have a whole block... This is stupid. <laughs> this is just stupid. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Perfect, perfect freaking sense. Yeah, definitely. Demon bird, get the freak out of my face! Or I will completely and utterly just... I don't even know anymore, okay? I just want to live in peace. And you're not letting me. In fact, you're impeding me every step you can take. And it's just not cool. Now, I'm thinking... We've built the blocks up too high. I don't have a pickaxe, so we're wasting nether hack. <laughs> oh... It's okay, caveman. It's okay. Everything's gonna be alright. And if it's not, it's your fault. And by that, I mean it's my fault. That's who I was talking about, you. Anyway. We've almost managed to place the crap. Yay. There. They can't break through this. They know for a fact that they cannot go through and spawn on Netherrack. But, oh. Alright. Now, I'm going to very stupidly turn the game mode back to the hard mode. And we're going to watch my inevitable death. So. Yep, I already hear one. Great. Just great. Demon bird, this is just annoying. There you are. There you are! I really don't like silverfish. This map has made me a silverfish hater. Look! They're cheating! They are cheating in this game! Drawing in free reinforcements from out of the line is cheating! Stupid silverfish. Now they're multiplying and I just... I don't even know. This is a pit of death. Just a pit of death, anger, despair, whatever you want to call it. I really wish I could go to the newer versions of Captain Minecraft. But I've made enough progress in this. And I don't want to end it. But I'm just saying, all I want, all I want, let's check our achievements menu. At this point in time, these are the achievements that we might in some way be able to accomplish if the game was nice. Diamonds to you. I am playing the single player, so that achievement is forever not in my reach. I've tried throwing diamonds to zombies, and they do not pick them up. Delicious fish. The one achievement that we could go for if I had my stuff. Into fire. 
No, blazes don't spawn in that nether, and I don't understand where they would be. We can't build a notch apple because there's no gold. Uh, we could probably do sniper duel if we had a spot on this map that was 50 meters away and had a skeleton nearby. Um, I, I don't want to end off Captive Minecraft, but I've tried being the nice guy. I've tried using my brain. I've tried everything that I can possibly think of to somehow survive in this map. And I have to say, it beat me. We've had a lot of fun going up to the top, going to the bottom, dying a thousand times due to gas spawning at the top, and or silverfish at the bottom. We've made some new friends such as Betsy and Bessie and Clucky. I think Clucky grew up. Oh no, Clucky's still there. There's Clucky and Pigsley. And of course you butcher. Here, have all my nether rack because I don't even know. Anyway, guys, tell me what I should do. Should I continue on with Captive Minecraft? This is literally a, this is a cry for help. This is a terrible, terrible day for me. Shall we end off the Captive Minecraft? Because in the past five episodes, we haven't made any progress, and all progress I did have got reset. Yay! It's it's just a really, really unfortunate series end, and I don't want to do it this way. But I feel like at this point in time, it might be the best best way. So I'm again asking you, the viewers, tell your friends, whatever. Just tell them, caveman lost to Captive Minecraft. And he's asking for your help to know what he should do. He can't even tell his caveman right now because he's lost his identity due to the deaths that have traumatized him so much. Anyway, guys, I'll talk to you guys later. Hope you guys somehow enjoyed this. See ya.